the formidable robot. Yep, another never-ending journey. It was exactly October of last year when a group of archivists and members of the ARG facility, including Thomas, recovered 400 terabytes hard drives containing an almost complete Beatles ARG called Number 9. The ARG is based on the Paul is Dead theory with Revolution 9 being the example. In the song, there's a segment where a voice says Number 9 constantly. When played backwards, the phrase is, Turn me on dead man. Someone decided to turn it into an ARG with corrupted video files, pictures containing cryptic meanings, and even song bites that claim the theory. Within the first hour, we conducted the forensic analysis on the hard drives. I was tasked in looking through the first of the hard drives, number 9. Luckily our boss provided burner laptops for events as such. Thanks for the advice boss. As soon as I insert the hard drive into the laptop, three files pop up, a text file called Turn Me On, a corrupted picture of Paul McCarthy with X marks scratched onto his eyes, and a video called Number 9.mkv. I read the text file, Turn Me On. The entire Word document was a transcript from a session between Paul McCartney and John Lennon, er, I mean John Lennon. Just so that I don't bore you, the transcript details Paul's concerns for the theories upon theories of his supposed death in 1966. John tells Paul that they're just rumors and that they shouldn't affect them too much. The transcript abruptly ends with Ringo telling the two to start recording the song they had, which was, Abladi, Ablada. What was the main focus was the video, number 9.mkv. As I clicked on the video, the video started with a picture of the group back in 1960 with the looping Turn Me On Dead Man phrase accompanying the background ambience. As it entails, the images get more and more unsettling including the infamous news broadcast of John Lennon's death. Flashing text accompanied with phrases like, John didn't like Paul, or, Abbey Road was a mistake. This is starting to become suspicious. Suddenly, the video abruptly paused, including the phrase stopping. It cuts to an altercation with Paul arguing with one of the Apple Records producers. The dialogue was muffled. But I could hear a clear phrase of, if these theories keep coming and coming, I'm afraid I'm gonna need to quit the band entirely. A click sound was heard. Footage of the Nowhere Man seen from Yellow Submarine started playing with no dialogue and in black and white. I was starting to get nervous. Then suddenly a loud ear tearing crash was heard followed by a yet deafeningly loud crackling sound and the scene melted. Too lazy for stupid sound effects. The video ended with the phrase switching to number 9 in a constant loop as it fades, like the songs you'd hear where it continues and then slowly fades out. I was feeling weak by this point, that bit with the crash and the crackling nearly took me by surprise. I'll need to go now. I'm starting to get shaky and my boss ordered me to get some water and to sit by the break room for lunch break. I'll report the next part tomorrow night. I'm coming for you through Digger Arrow. <laughs>